guys welcome back so um today i'm just gonna go over what i ate today so it is day four of my keto journey um it is monday january i don't have my fitbit on 14th 14th january 14th <laughs> um so i just um put together my um my last clip for my other video. So I'm going to leave that down below. It is, um, my keto, um, day one through three, um, which was a little challenging. And if you go, um, you know, if you did see that video, let me know, um, what you thought of it. So, um, day four was a little bit easier for me. Um, it was my, you know, it was a Monday, so I was back at work, and I had my coffee this morning, the same coffee that I've been drinking, 16 ounces of coffee with two, um, two teaspoons, not tablespoons, teaspoons of erythritol and um, a tablespoon of heavy whipping cream. So that tied me over, for, you know, for a little bit. I got to work, and I had two pieces of bacon and an avocado um, at about 9.30. And then at my lunchtime, I actually ate at about one o'clock um, and I wasn't too hungry, but I felt like I needed to eat. Uh, I was really trying to listen to like what my body needs, you know? So I'm like, oh, like noon. I was like, I'm not hungry. My stomach's not growling. I don't feel anything, whatever. I'll keep going. So about one o'clock, I was like, okay, I probably need to eat something. So I had um, five ounces of my roast that I had cooked on Saturday night. So I had five ounces of that and then four, um, no, wait, it was five, five spears of asparagus and then um, probably about a fourth of a cup. It wasn't that much. It was what I had left over from that dinner. So about a fourth of a cup of broccoli from that night. So it was literally my dinner from Saturday for lunch today. So that's what I had. It is now 6.35 and I'm just going to, um, I got a side salad. My husband got me a side salad the other yesterday um, from McDonald's and I didn't want it. So I'm just going to go ahead and I have some chicken left over from the other night and I'm going to heat that up, throw it on the salad and I'm probably going to do some buffalo sauce on top because this girl <laughs> loves buffalo sauce. Um, I like ranch. But I just, I just want some heat right now. I don't know if you can tell. I am kind of sick right now. I'm trying to get to go over this cold. My, it's like my sinuses. So um, my AGM recommended, hey, why don't you eat something spicy? It'll clear out your nose. Well, jokingly, I was like, ah, no, no. But it made me want buffalo sauce because that's the only thing that I can think of like spicy that I like right now um, that I can have. Um, so I'm going to do that. And then I think... I don't know. I think I want something kind of salty with it. So I was thinking maybe some pork rinds. I got these barbecue pork rinds and I tried them and they were not bad, which is so surprisingly because that sounds so gross to me, like to think about pork rinds, but, um, I got plain ones to do like a, a breading for chicken. And then I grabbed barbecue ones. Cause I'm like, if I want, you know, a chip or something. So the size of what I got is really small and I don't have a lot of chicken. I'm going to actually grab it and show you. Okay, so this is the side salad that I got. Um, it's from McDonald's. I'm gonna take the tomato off because that doesn't even sound appealing. I have this chicken from the other day. Um, I'm gonna heat this up and I might add, there's like no cheese on this whatsoever. There's like slivers of carrots. Um, I think I'm gonna add this to a bowl and add some more spinach to it to make it a little bit more filling. Add the chicken to it and add some cheese and then the buffalo sauce and then that's going to be my dinner. I'm going to hold off on the pork rinds for right now. If I want it, I want it later or whatever. I'll grab a couple, but it's not like I'm not just going to add it to my meal for tonight. And then I also have my dessert from last night that if I want um, after dinner, it's like it's a lot of fat. So um, I'll just probably do like one tablespoon of it just to kind of kick that that uh, um what is that called? Just to kick the feeling, I don't know, my sweet tooth. I usually get after dinner, so um, that'll probably tie me over, but um, kick the urge. <laughs> so that will kick the urge that I have um, first for anything sweet. Um, but I'm not gonna try, like, I'm not going into it thinking that's what I'm gonna have. I'm planning it out. I'm being prepared. If I want something salty when I'm done with this, I have the pork rinds. If I want something sweet, I have the, um, the dessert so that's my goal that's my plan can we just talk about how you should not have buffalo sauce when you're um, sick 
My lips are burning. My nose is running and burning. I don't even know if I can finish this. So, I have quite a bit left. And what I've been doing is eating these uh, barbecue pork rinds to kind of help kill the heat. But I notice it's not really like my inside of my mouth because I can usually stand buffalo sauce. Whew, it is my lips burning. Oh, so I don't know if I'm going to be able to finish that because it hurts really bad. So if not, I'm just going to snack on, I'm not too hungry to be honest. So I'll just probably snack on the, some of those, um, pork rinds. I'll try it. Like, it's like, I have to like try to miss like the, my mouth or something. See, like I could do that. Oh, maybe I just need to keep eating up. That's like so weird and awkward to eat like that. <sighs> that was gross, I'm sorry. Hmm. My gosh, that just burns. Okay, I'm gonna try to keep eating. If I can't do it, I'm just gonna eat some pork rinds and call it a night. Whew. Okay, so it is Tuesday, January 15th. Um, I, it's about, uh, 11:50. I am starving. Like I am so hungry this morning. I had um three it was three pieces of bacon, but they were like smaller pieces of bacon, so equivalent to two um is what I'm going to count it as at least. And I had my coffee, but I am just so hungry. Um and I forgot to like cook a lunch. I brought some snacks and stuff, but I didn't want to try to do that for lunch. Um so I'm going to Wendy's. They have this like Southwest chicken salad. Um, that sounded really good. Pepper jack cheese, um, avocado, grilled chicken, bacon, like, you know, so it sounded good. I think I'm gonna get a full one though. I am so hungry. Whatever I don't eat, I don't eat. So that's what I'm gonna get. And hopefully it'll work and tie me over. Um, and if I don't have to eat my snacks later, that would be great too, but we'll see. Um, but I will kind of show you what my salad looks like when I get it. Hopefully it's good. Oh, I don't want it to not be good. I've never had it before, but it sounded so good. So the struggle is real right now. We have a lot of food going at work and it smells really good and I really want it, but we're not doing it. We, as in my boss is trying to eat better too. So um, that's what I'm gonna get for lunch and hopefully I'll be good. Hey guys, so it is still Tuesday. Um, I don't know what day, the, the 15th? That was the wrong light. <laughs> um, the 15th, I believe. And I had that um, Southwest avocado salad from Wendy's for lunch. And then I had, I kind of snacked on, I brought like pepperoni, salami, beef sticks, and cheese. And I just snacked on it. I didn't eat the whole thing because um, the whole thing would probably be like a lunch serving. Um, so I'm not like super hungry right now. But I just feel like I just want to eat and just be done for the night, if that makes sense. So I am just going to cook up like two eggs, maybe do like another omelet or something like I did on Saturday, but not that, not that much, not that big. Probably just some spinach, um, mushrooms, and some eggs, and then just be done. I'm not super hungry, but I do feel like I need to eat and then just be done for the night. So that's what I'm going to do. And then I'm going to just relax. For the rest of the night sounds like a plan right okay so i just finished um making my dinner so it's not very pretty but i just did an egg white omelet i don't know if it's gonna focus i just did an egg white omelet with spinach mozzarella cheese and mushrooms so that's what i'm having for dinner tonight and i think it'll it'll do the trick and i'll be done and, and good for the night so i'm gonna eat this and i will see you tomorrow Good morning guys so um you were in my steering wheel right now <laughs> uh sorry about that but i wanted to talk about yesterday so 
part of my job, I'm in sales. Um, I have to do sales calls and I have to do chamber lunches and stuff like that. <clears throat> well, yesterday I had a chamber lunch and and it was really hard. It was really hard. So um, it was at a bar. It was actually, it's pretty much just a bar. Um, I mean, they have food, food, but they um, came up with, you know, some of their dishes or whatever and, and bulked it and stuff like that. Um, the thing that upsets me is I had to eat some of it and it wasn't even good. So, you know, like, um, okay, so I put salad on my plate and I put ranch dressing on it. That's fine, you know, and I try to do like a heftier salad so that I could eat that first and then, you know, it'll be fine. So, um, come on. Wow. This truck, like just cut off somebody that was like gonna go in front of like was gonna go in front of me and then I was turning behind them Whew. okay so um so I put the salad on my plate and then they had green beans and so I was like okay load up on green beans um I did not like the green beans but I ate every single green bean so that it would fill me up before I had to eat the rest of the stuff so they put the chicken on the plate and it was breaded chicken and that was it was not good um but I picked through the inside and just tried to get the chicken part out of it um and then they had <clears throat> noodles like this noodles I don't know it was disgusting I tried one just one it was disgusting so um and then they came around with dessert which was brownies and they asked people would you like one and I was like no thank you so <laughs> I even turned down dessert uh, I had just water with the meal. Um, so yeah, I mean, I tried really hard. Um, there were some things I, I shouldn't have ate, like, you know, the chicken because there was breading and stuff like that on it, but I tried to just eat the middle of it and trust me, it wasn't that good. Um, and then, so then I was hungry, right? Like I was hungry. I didn't have enough food. Um, so my boss and I had went to Big Lots because she needed to grab something. And I grabbed a jar of pickles. Which is fine, right? Pickles, fine. Um, and then at the checkout line, there was like this um, kind of like trail mix kind of thing. It was cashews, um, almonds, cr dried cranberries, and raisins and stuff. And I was like, you know what? I'm just so hungry. I'll just try to pick out the cashews and almonds. Well, I got back to the office and I was sitting there and, you know, I was, I was picking it out, you know, whatever. And then like some, some other coworkers and stuff come in and they're talking and I just literally didn't even pay attention and started eating. And those were the cranberries I know for a fact were loaded with extra sugars so I'm like really upset with myself. And when I realized it, I just threw the bag away. I was done. I was like, you know what? No. So I didn't have like a lot, but I had enough just to uh, make me feel, uh, I don't know, you know? So, uh, so that was like my mess up for yesterday, but I still feel like it's okay. You know, there are things I probably won't be in ketosis soon, um, but we shall see. And... Um, I know like today I'm actually getting my magnesium and, uh, there was something else. I can't think of it. So I'm actually like, you know, I'll start taking those tonight and stuff. Um, so for breakfast, um, I'm going to try to hold off for breakfast as long as I can today. Um, I have my coffee with me this morning and my water and I'm really enjoying this coffee. So, um, you know, it should tie me over. And then, um, probably about 10 o'clock when our kitchen closes at work, I will grab some bacon. Um, or at least grab some before then and just have it sitting there. Uh, because I did bring an avocado. So if I can have that closer to 11 and then wait to have my lunch, um, about two, which I brought the chicken, uh, chicken bake, um, that I made the other night, which I will leave the recipe for that down or the video for that down below. Cause that will be up before this one. Um, so I keep 
keep hitting the edges. Um, so yeah, so that's my plan. And then tonight I, I think I'm going to make, um, uh, lettuce wrap tacos. We had that. I, that's what I forgot yesterday. We had, um, lettuce wrap buffalo chicken for dinner last night. It was so good. It was so freaking good. Even my husband was like, oh, I could totally have this often. So that is definitely going to be one of our go-to meals too. Like I'm going to make note of that so that we know that that's one of our go-to meals. And um, like he put blue cheese dressing on his. I put ranch dressing on top of mine. I will put a picture right now. Did it that look good? Oh my gosh, it's so good. <laughs> but um, that was my dinner yesterday. So I still try, like I was like, okay, I'm gonna go really, really good for dinner, you know? Um, and I didn't have, oh, I had like so, a thing of my dessert that I made um, with the cream cheese and chocolate and stuff like that. Um, so, so yeah, I did really good the rest of the day and stuff, but I'm a little upset about, about the lunch situation. But today, I, you know, I'm going to be good. I'm going to try really hard. And um, I actually, um, you know, I'm still losing weight. So that's great. I think I'm down four and a half pounds since January 1st. So that's pretty good, right? I don't know. I feel like keto, you like lose it faster. But I'm okay with the, the consistency that I'm losing because um, that's like, will be five, you know, like five pounds in two weeks. That's pretty good. Um, so we'll see. I didn't, you know, I didn't start keto on the first. So I definitely, I'm tomorrow will technically be my, my keto day seven, you know? Um, so yeah, I think I'm doing okay. And I will check in with you guys later.